Hey, to Wall Street now, it's been just one day since the Dow Jones Industrial Average plunged nearly 1,600 points. Yesterday was the worst single-day point decline in history. ABC's Linda Lopez has the story. The snapshot after Monday's jaw-dropping day on Wall Street. At the close, the Dow suffering its biggest one-day point drop ever. Stocks have wiped out over a trillion dollars in value in the span of a few days. In the last five days, the Dow down 8%. ABC's Rebecca Jarvis says in real terms, that means if you had invested $1,000 in the market one week ago, today you would have closer to 920 if you had put $1,000 into the market one year ago, you would have made, as of today, $200 on top of that. Meaning that money would still be ahead in spite of yesterday's losses. As for what caused the crazy ride? Fear. The improving economy and wage increases have sparked fear that after a decade of rock-bottom interest rates, the Federal Reserve will start hiking rates to prevent inflation. As those rates go up, loans get more expensive, and in response, people and businesses spend less. But Greg McBride of Bankrate.com says that the losses are just a healthy correction. There's this natural tendency to think, oh no, what's wrong? There's nothing wrong. Uh, the economic fundamentals are better now than they've been at any point for more than a decade. Uh, what you're seeing is just some profit taking because of the fact that interest rates are going up. But why are interest rates going up? because the economy's getting better, and that's really the big picture to focus on. Linda Lopez, ABC News, New York.